Hi there, I'm Bill from Openreach, and today I'm going to quickly tell you about how we get fibre into flats or multi-dwelling units. Um, so in the basement or, or in, a, in a cupboard, we would have a main service box, and, and in here the fibre would come in from outside uh, and be jointed up, as you can see there, inside there. And then that would run out on a cable. This is called an in, uh, Invisilite cable. There's 12 fibres in here. And that, there's, so there's a different, couple of different options. This particular option, we can glue this up into a corner of a ceiling in a corridor. Uh, and then at the customer, we have a breakout point, uh, and that's to feed individual customers. That'd be possibly in a corridor. Or we can actually have the cable coming out of this box and going up above a ceiling. So this cable is universal. It, it can go into a, um, a corner of a corridor, it could go on a skirting board, or it could go above if there's a full ceiling available. All this can be hidden away in a full ceiling, and aesthetically it looks really better do, doing it like that. But, you know, there's different options. At the customer end, at each individual customer, you've got the ONT, the optical network termination. This is where the optics uh, connects to your router, out of that little device there. The actual cable is in one piece. So the installation engineer would come along this side, tiny little cable there, and again, that would be possibly glued in a skirting board along the edge of a, a ceiling. So it's, it's quite, you know, it's, it doesn't, it's not very visible. And that would go out at that point and come into the, the corridor connection or above ceiling connection. And that would plug in to the network going back out to provide the service. This, the, the excess of this will be coiled up inside here because obviously this has got a terminated, pre-terminated optical plug which plugs into your equipment and that serves your router.